Well, we're at the time of the calendar when some teams go through a mid-season lull. Graham, what has to be done to avoid that? Well, first of all, you have to keep your composure. You cannot panic. And, of course, this is when a coach earns his keep. Motivation becomes key. Keeping the players focused and making sure nobody starts coasting. Let's check out Milwaukee's starting lineup. Middleton is the three, with Giannis playing the power forward. MP is out there with Drew Holiday. And it's Lopez in at the center position. Now here's Middleton. And here's MP. And it's Lopez. That time on the assist by MP. And using that size to his advantage. I mean, I like it when Lopez establishes himself inside and looks to capitalize. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. Yeah, and in close games like this one, B.A., you need toughness. Guys who will run to the fight and get after it. And he gets it to go as they call the foul. He's on his way to the line for one more. He was He's able to ball. simply lay it in over the top of the smaller man. Here's Holiday. And about a minute gone in the first quarter. MP no good. Chicago has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Green with the ball. Guarded by Anadokounmpo. Ball passes to DeRozan. Right side, Levine. Let's it fly. Releases from the wing and drills it. DeMar is a magnet for defensive attention. You see the overreaction leading to a wide open man. MP left side. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Holiday. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Now here's Levine. A dangerous offensive player. His scoring average stands at almost 30 a game. From about 16. And the whistle blows. And it's going to be over the back here. The way he was going over and through the man in front of him, he should have known the whistle was coming. Couldn't have been more obvious about it. That's just a lack of discipline. Not the way you're taught to do it. Green, the pass to DeRozan. Here's Ball. Pass to Green. From outside the arc. Rebound by Middleton. The Bucks have gone two of three from the floor. Smitty, what you like about this Bulls offense, they tend to take good shots. Reason why, B.A., they've got veteran scorers who are disciplined, patient. It's difficult for defenses to speed them up. MP's gone one for three on the night. DeRozan finds ball. And here's Drummond. Outside for Levine. From the arc. And the Bulls get it back. Here's Green. Comes up empty down low. The Bucks trail. Pass to Holiday. MP against Levine. Throws it up high. They now take the lead. Lopez. Saw his teammate with a path to the rim. And boom! Lobbed it up there beautifully. Very smooth catch and finish. Now here's Levine. His last outing, we saw him score 22. Here's Drummond. On an Akumpo with the block. Heads up defense by Giannis. His ability to anticipate the shot pays off with the block. And how about that replay? Man, you got to appreciate the hustle on defense. I mean, letting them know up front that he's on the hunt tonight and eager to knock away shots. I love it. Here's Levine. Six to shoot. Green for three. Sinks that one after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. To the inside. Here's MP. And the shot is good on the assist by Holiday. The underrated vision of Holiday. I like it when he's distributing, and I think his coach does as well. Outside Levine. Pass to Drummond. Ball outside. To the paint. And that one's good. Green. Green's got five. 
It's no secret that Lonzo is an elite facilitator. If you're open, he will get you the ball. Holiday passes to MP. Anadokounmpo with it. Green covering. And Anadokounmpo, the bucket, on the assist from Holiday. Holiday's got three assists in the game. Here's Levine. Great D that time from Anadokounmpo. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. And let's take a moment to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for Milwaukee. Establishing a pink presence early in the game. It really helps and pays big dividends down the line because it frees up your perimeter. And from the jump, they've also clearly been focused on running effective plays here tonight. And there's been a lot of high-quality distribution from them on the floor. And Drummond with the jam! There's not many that dunks it as powerful as Andre Drummond. He's explosive at 280 pounds. On the wing, MP. The three. Drummond grabs the miss. Drummond's got four rebounds in the game. Levine with it. Guarded now by Holiday. And it's hammered home by Green. A way to rise to the occasion and snatch back the momentum. That's the competitor in him. Close game. Let me have this one. Now here's MP. Anadokounmpo outside. MP with it. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Drummond's got five rebounds in the game. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. Now here's Middleton. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Oh, it's stolen by DeRozan. Pass to Levine. The jam by Levine. This is what we've come to expect from Zach Levine. Poetry in air. Time called here. The Bucks decide to talk it over. Well, Grant, one thing Levine has done considering the league, he's taken his strength training very seriously. No question. I mean, he can play a much more physical. The Bucks shooting an average of 43% from the floor. Javante Green out there with Andre Drummond. Then it's Lonzo Ball. Then there's Ayo DeSumo. And it's Levine in at the small forward position. That's the Bulls' five as we get into the second quarter. From deep, MP. Offensive board. On to Kumpo. Some solid defense from Drummond. That's the shot you hope for. Right at the rim. Just couldn't capitalize. Pass to Ball. Now here's Levine. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. First person You know Zach Levine's never averaged fewer than double-digit points in his career, but he didn't get picked for the All-Star team until his seventh season. You know, one area where Levine improved in his first All-Star season was efficiency, Smitty. You're correct. His scoring totals were always impressive, but his effective shooting percentage took a big jump up. Zach's playing the smartest basketball of his career. Here's Ball, and he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. They pin that one on Giannis Antetokounmpo. An unselfish young guard, Lonzo Ball takes pride, in my opinion, in the success of others. Probably why his teammates love playing with him. At the line for two. That one misses, so he goes one for two. Despite all the glitz and glamour around the Ball family, Lonzo is the ultimate team first player. Someone everyone wants to play with. Here's MP. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. All right, for Lonzo, what makes him such a great teammate, Smitty? What it is, B.A., he's always looking to others first. Lonzo loves to pass the rock. Defensively, he gives you full effort. So playing D, sharing the rock like Lonzo does, those traits make you popular in the locker room. Thanks. Well, MP in their last game against the Celtics just played phenomenal. 
He added 29 points and did what he always does. He got others involved. Yeah, what else is new? Once again, he left the defense grasping for answers. That's good stuff, Allie. He really made his presence felt in that one, doing some heavy lifting. And I think he'll try and repeat that performance tonight. And I'm sure Coach is hoping for that as well, but every night's different. Who knows, maybe someone else will have to step up this time. Pass to Desumu. Back to ball. Outside Levine. Stolen by MP. In transition. Here come the Bucks. The pull up J. Here's Lopez. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Lopez has got six. And Lopez is mostly an inside or outside guy, but he'll take advantage at times of a mid range J if he finds one. Ball passes to Drummond. Double team on Drummond. Inside. Here's Desumu. That one's in there. Drummond with the assist. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. Oh, a great look there. Brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. And out of bounds, it'll be Chicago ball. Off on the time or it may have been a miscommunication. Either way, turnover. Second quarter play, almost three minutes gone here. Ball outside. And he lobs it up top. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. In transition. Here come the Bucks. MP shot is good. If they keep Three. finding steals like that, they won't be in the hole much longer. Chicago leading. Ball outside. Pass to Drummond. Here's to Sumu. Here's the three. Anadokounmpo grabs the board. Anadokounmpo has got rebound number five here tonight. In the air. It doesn't go for him. Ooh, excellent D there from Ball. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, Buff fighting ball. hard for every miss. In the first half, you want second to stay aggressive, foul. but you also want to be careful. Foul. That is his second foul already. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. Grant, we always talk about great footwork for post players, but how about perimeter players? You know, I'm glad you brought that up, B.A. Great perimeter players have elite footwork. The footwork helps to create the opportunity to score. Whether that's shooting a three off the dribble or even in the post up. Great, elite, fantastic, iconic guards who could do it all have superior footwork. Believe that. He's had a tough time getting it going, and he's put this team behind the eight ball. Here's Desumu to the left side wing. Six on the shot clock. Here's Ball. Outside for Levine. Puts up a three. Bulls keep it alive. Here's Green. Oh, it's blocked by Lopez. Just an effective shot blocker. Remains Lopez using all of that seven feet, and he does a great job of picking his spots. So it's Chicago now. Shot clock at six. Here's Desumu. And another shot. It's been a grind for them in the second quarter. Still with the lead, but having to work for their points now. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. This is how you stay in the game. They're doing a beautiful job from the line. 100% this quarter. And the Bulls making a change here. Jones has checked in. And high riser. The Bees want some dunk contest. Zach knows how to put on a show. Middleton passes to MP. Here's Green. Kumpo with the block. Fast break. Here we go. MP shot is good. I mean, the versatility of Middleton. Not just a scorer, also a solid passer and distributor. Outside Levine. It's stolen by MP. And he hits it to tie the game. MP's got 15. Their defense is getting beat up the floor. And no adjustments have been made at all. 
and that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by the lead. The Bulls making a switch here. Checking Beverly's checked in. For your Bulls. A deep three from MP. Kept alive. Another shot. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. 17 points in the game. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Outside Levine. Back to Jones. Clock at six. Ball outside. From deep three-point range. He can't get that one to fall. And Milwaukee the other way now. A tough loss coming against Boston in their last game. It's never easy to win games when you're missing free throws. They had to be better, especially on the road. Each miss fired up that crowd even more. And that'll be Milwaukee's ball as it goes out of bounds. Bucks able to keep the possession. Chicago making some changes. DeMar DeRozan comes in for Drummond. And it's Caruso in for ball. Bobby Portis has checked in for Milwaukee. Ingles comes in for Chris Middleton. An MVP caliber talent, the rise of Giannis from scrawny teenager to bulked up superstar has been great to watch. That free throw, no good. Giannis Antetokounmpo taking two shots. That one's no good. Fantastic ball movement for them tonight. But things are definitely working offensively. A balanced attack is just so much harder to defend. Ingles finds MP. Pass to Portis. MP against Caruso. And the Bucks miss again. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. You just missed it. Ingles against Levine. Fires for three. The rebound by the Bucks. Cupo's got rebound number 11. And Ingles gets Joe it to go. Ingles. The assist by Cumpo. Ingles got five. There's the work Ingles has put into his strength and conditioning. Takes the hit and still able to convert. Levine, good. And boy, has this been a competitive matchup thus far. Yeah, these teams have swapped leads seven times already. And we're not even in the second half. Got it. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Beverly outside. Now here's Levine. Ten points for him. Caruso misses. And about Caruso, he's not a stat stuffer, Smitty, but he does everything. No doubt about that, B.A. Not flashy on the court, but at the end of the Number night, three. he's done a little bit three of points. everything. The ultimate floor general. Man, he has been locked in this quarter, shouldering the load at the offensive end. Two minutes. Up the floor, and Holiday powers it home. Impressive. You like the aggressive mindset. Holiday's not just floating on the perimeter. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by MP. Crowder, he's checked in for Milwaukee. Allen comes in for Holiday. Crowder. Grayson Allen. Chicago trailing here. Now Beverly. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Here's DeRozan. And again, Chicago no good. You expect him to make that, especially from that distance. Releases. MP finds Portis. Bobby Portis rolling off that pick, going downhill once he gets moving. It's hard to slow him down. Knocks it loose. And now we have an intentional foul. So it's the Milwaukee Bucks finishing the quarter with an eight-point lead. Defense is setting the tone. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. Just tuning in. Thanks for being with us. Second half of this game still to play. On the floor for Milwaukee. 
At forward, it's the talented Giannis and Middleton. Drew Holiday out there with MP. And it's Lopez in at the center. And here's Ball. Levine with it. Back to Ball. Giannis with the rebound. On oh, Kumpo has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. MP outside. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming in. Free throw good, MP. Team foul. And both free throws good for MP. Here's Ball. DeRozan outside. Ball against Holiday. Pass to Levine. No good on the triple. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. Here's MP. And it's Chicago with the board. And with a little over a minute gone by, the second half is underway. And the basket by DeRozan. This is where Levine has really expanded his game, avoiding tunnel vision and getting others involved. Stolen by Drummond. Levine against Holiday. Levine passes to Drummond. Back to Levine. And he's going for the oop here. And Drummond with the jam. With the flexibility to adjust at the rim, Drummond can catch the pass almost anywhere and still throw it down. Holiday finds MP. Green against Tana de Kumpo. It's stolen by Green. Three on three. Here's Ball. Rebound, Milwaukee. Tana de Kumpo is Milwaukee in the lead. Holiday passes to Tana de Kumpo. Middleton against Green. Back to Anadokounmpo. Six to shoot. Kicks it out to Middleton. And a great assist by Anadokounmpo. And that one goes in. Anadokounmpo's got his fourth assist with that last one. DeRozan outside. Here's Green. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. They pin that one on Giannis Antetokounmpo. And he knocks down the first one. At the line for shoot. And so he hits both. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Levine with a steal. And they're pushing it up. Ball with it. Guarded now by Holiday. Outside for Green. Pass to Levine. Stolen by MP. Uses the glass to finish the layup. MP's gotten four this quarter. He has taken it upon himself to score the ball as much as possible for his team. He's not looking to pass it right now. And we just had to see that mobile one drive one more time. Great stuff. Oh, the energy and focus on display. Saw an opportunity to get inside, and they continue to build at this lead. And what a phenomenal replay of that impressive rejection. Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. Pass the ball. DeRozan outside. Now Levine takes the three. Nails it from beyond the arc. Levine's got 13. Slick shot by Zach right off the pass. He just goes straight into his motion. On the wing, MP. Kumpo is doubled. It's good. Giannis Give him eight. High offensive IQ. He makes great reads and adjustments on the fly. Outside Levine. Yet another steal from him. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing his will at the defensive end. You gotta love it. And it gets even worse for them. I mean, he just waltzes down the lane, extending their advantage. Ugh. Not good. A uncontested shot at the rim. You have to compete at all times. 
He's been tremendous at corralling misses all night long. He has led this team in rebounding and also taken on the role of enforcer. Here in the second half, they've just found better shots. For them, the first half was maybe more of a filling out process. Now it's winning time. Milwaukee has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. Middleton finds MP. Down low. From deep. Good. And Ana Dacumpo gets the assist. MP's got 33 points. Continue from where he left off. First three-pointer of this half, fourth of the game. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Well, guys, with the yearly roster moves, it might be hard for the casual fan to keep track. But Commissioner Silver said it's a necessary side effect. He said, quote, we tried to tie performance to pay in a closer way, and I think that's what you see with shorter contracts. Brian, more player movement has been the result. Yeah, good point, Ali. Thanks. Nasumu, he's checked in for Chicago. Here's Levine. Oh, no good again that time. For Milwaukee, they've gotten six of eight shots to go and looking good since the break. MP outside. Launches a three. DeRozan with the rebound. For Chicago, they've gone cold here in this third quarter. Just three of nine. And a different kind of score. DeRozan attempted 741 mid-range jumpers last year. Almost 300 more than anyone else. Here's DeSumo. And he drops in the layup off the glass. That's a well-timed, well-coordinated play. Comes right off the pick for the lay-in. Outside Holiday. Pass to Middleton. Now here's MP. DeRozan with the rebound. DeRozan's got his sixth rebound on the night. And Grant DeRozan, high volume from the mid-range and extremely accurate. You know, B.A., he consistently makes about half those shots. And defensively, you know that's his favorite area. But his ball handling and vertical negate anything you throw at him. MP, the pass to Holiday. MP outside, five to shoot. The three is up. That one doesn't drop. And Chicago will go the other way with it. They host the Pistons after this one, and they'll be reaching the back half of the four game home stretch. The three point shooting has been on point here in the second half. Outside Holiday. Pass to Lopez. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. And Lopez is... Well, the Bulls shooting an average of 43% from the floor. Levine and DeRozan, the star-studded wings. Green out there with Derrick Jones. And it's Ball in at the one. So that's the five in the game for Chicago. First team five. Outside Levine. Honor to Kumpo against Green. Shot clock at six. There's Ball with a three. Rebound by Middleton. Middleton's got his fourth rebound in this one. To the middle. MP. That's good. And so Middleton with the assist. Middleton's got three assists now in this one. Ball against Holiday. Pass to DeRozan. Levine with it. To take the lead. Rebound by the Bucks. Adana Kumpo has got his 16th rebound on the night. MP, that was good. Smart play by Giannis. Moving the ball with a purpose leads to a great look. Chicago's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Ball passes to Levine. Jones against Portis. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Second, the officials were foul. right on top of that one. Second team foul. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats at for the, the Bucks. High effort, fast break plays. 
They have been very effective for them in this game, generating a lot of points for them. Well, another thing they've been doing right in this one is making the most of turnovers. Lots of points for them tonight off of them. MP, the pass to Anadokounmpo, and they double up Anadokounmpo. Holiday. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. One thing about Holiday, he knows how to get defenders off balance. We'll see what he can do at the line. And he can't make the second free throw either. Missed them both. I can't believe he missed those shots. Wow, he is usually lights out from there. Shot is good by Levine. All about converting your opportunities. He just hit his second three of this half. Third of the night. MP right side. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Kicks it out to MP. And they'll get another chance. And he lobs it up to the rim. And the jam by Anadokounmpo. The reach of Giannis really helps out here, allowing him to beat out the defense and win a second-chance shot. Outside Levine. Takes it inside over MP. Levine can't hit. For Milwaukee, they've gone three of four in the fourth and looking confident on offense. Here's MP. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. It's going to be on Lonzo Ball. Free throw good, MP. So he gets them both. Just under two and a half minutes Ooh, gone by now in the final quarter. Just a little too aggressive. His fifth foul of the night. Expect them to go right at him to try to pick up number six. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. Ladies and gentlemen, your Bulls Youth Dance Team. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Billy Donovan was saying to the team. He focused on perimeter play at both ends. On D, he wants to prevent open looks from deep. And at their own end, he thinks they can create better shots with better ball movement. We'll see if he gets his wish. Back to you. Good job there, Allie. Thanks. There's ball with a three. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Levine. Levine's got assist number eight now on the night. Oh, they get a hand on it. And a pass break now for the Bulls. Oh, wow! Crazy good! You know, he's a triple threat in the open court. He can beat you from the inside, outside, and everything in between. We got to see that one again. That block was all-out effort. What a powerful rejection. He's not wanting them to get an advantage in this competitive game. Number Drops three. in the three. For three. This is the very definition of a back-and-forth contest. Yes. Neither side taking its foot off the gas. I'm expecting a spectacular finish. DeRozan passes to Ball. And here's Levine. Good on the shot. Levine's got 12 points in just the second half. He's hot this quarter, getting the shots he wants, and he's delivering. Just an awesome display of athleticism on our AT&T 5G Slam Cam. And that one drops for him. Down the stretch, this is when they need him the most, and he is delivering. Ball passes to DeRozan. Here's Levine. Let's go with a three. The rebound by the Bucks. Portis has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. First free throw is good. Andre Drummond is checked in for Jones. At the line for the ball. And both free throws good for MP. In the second half, their free throw percentage has improved. Hitting in the low 80s now. Outside Levine. Stolen by MP. Holiday finds MP. From deep. Got a piece of it. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Just five to shoot. They shoot again. With the clock winding down. And it's good on the layup. And the Bucks lead by six. 
<laughs> they're playing a lot more aggressively on the offensive boards in the second half, racking up a ton of second chance points. Now here's Drummond. And here's Ball over Holiday. The Bulls with another miss. To the paint. Here's Portis. And that one's good with extra effort on the glass. Must put a body on Portis. He loves to crash the offensive glass. Outside Levine. Pass to DeRozan. Now ball. On the wing, Levine to halt the run. Rebounded by the Bucks. This is the shot they wanted to get. Right guy, right spot, wrong result. MP, the pass to Anadokounmpo. Kicks it out to MP. Fires the three. Drummond grabs the miss. Drummond's got rebound number 13 tonight with that one. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three-second call. Timeout call, Milwaukee. <laughs> and we'd all no, love to hear what goes on in those huddles, but we just get the snapshots. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see Our on the floor. Makes a noise. It's time for T-shirts. And now let's take a look at the New Balance Player of the Game. This is special. We are witnessing a legendary performance here tonight. He is like levels above everyone else on the floor. Something must have clicked for him in warm-ups tonight. He's just come out and he has run wild. I'm telling you, the added pressure of the road really brings out the best in him. You can tell he enjoyed playing so well in front of an unfriendly crowd. Pass to MP. Tipped. Here's Levine. Oh, and the jam by Levine. Impressive night scoring the ball for Zach. He knows how to put on a show. Middleton outside. Now here's MP. He's covered by Levine. Ball outside. Green for three. He can't get it to go. Milwaukee goes the other way with it. Here's Holiday. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It's going to be on Lonzo Ball. Every day, Holiday can be relied upon to bring focus, from the energy, team. toughness. And he's a terrific Two competitor. Shots. And he drops a first. Holiday hits them both. At just about 85% from the line tonight, they've looked more and more comfortable as the game's gone on. Here's Levine for three. Rebound, Milwaukee. Portis has got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. It's Middleton on the wing. Back to MP. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Outside Holiday. Here's Anadokounmpo. He's covered by Levine. That's good from Holiday on the assist by Anadokounmpo. Ada Kumpo has got eight assists here tonight. Timeout called here. Chicago, Chicago decides to talk it over. Heads up, fans. Who wants a free T-shirt? Once again, a big round of applause for your Chicago Lovable. Here's Ball. Here's DeRozan. Goes back up. In deep, Drummond finishes. They get this rebound, but they haven't been able to keep up on the boards. They're lucky the game is as close as it is. Pass to MP. Let's a three fly. Rebounded by Green. Man, at what point do you blame the play caller more than the player? And it's DeRozan missing. Okay, when you're trying to make a comeback, you can't be hucking up low percentage threes. You have to find a better shot within the offense. Count that one. 
And the Bucks lead by 11. One of the stronger guards in the lead. Holiday will take it up inside any chance you give him. Middleton against DeRozan. Ball outside. Pass to Levine. Down to five on the shot clock. Over MP. And the Bulls get it back. Wow, another opportunity. Just everything going their way. Pretty much the story of this game. Here's Milwaukee. They're on an 18-6 run. Now out of the Kumpo. Drummond defending. Inside. Here's Ball. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Levine. The D has to push Ball out of there. He's superb at capitalizing from this area. MP left side. Back to Anacumpo. MP outside. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. So the first one drops. And that'll push the lead to double digits. Shooting for Milwaukee. Number three. And both free throws good for MP. And the Bulls shooting just 37% since the fourth quarter got started. Here's DeRozan. Milwaukee with the rebound. Well, Grant, this game looks just about over. B.A., all they really need to do is just work that clock, don't turn it over, and this game is a wrap. So Chicago going with an almost entire new group here. Simonovic, he's checked in for Green. Terry comes in for DeRozan. Caruso, he's checked in for Levine. And it's White in for Ball. Well, they're going to win, so he should just relax. Carter, he's checked in for the Bucks. Buck substitution, Javon Carter. There's 39 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Here's White. Lays it up and banks it in. I think you're going to see more and more of this from Kobe White, challenging the defenders as a 6'5 guard. Pass to Portis. Carter against White. Six on the shot clock. The Bucs need to get up a shot here. The fadeaway. Samanovic with the rebound. 13 feet out. Off on that one. So this one belongs to the Bucs. Exceptional the effort on the road. They were ready and they were focused. Fans, focused indeed. I mean, it takes a strong Please. mental Please. approach Please. to block Please. out the distractions. Please. These guys we'll stepped up 100%. Time. And that'll do it, folks. For Grant Hill, Steve Smith, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for watching tonight's game. We'll see you next time.